What's going on you guys? In this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to make your photos actually fit on Instagram. Have you ever taken a photo and for some reason, it just doesn't fit. It either crops out the feet or crops out the hand or crops out the head and then you gotta make it square when it wasn't meant to be a square. Well, just follow these steps and I'm gonna show you how it works on Instagram. Okay, so let's say you just took some photos and you're like, okay, you edit it and well, you're ready to put it on Instagram. So you're gonna crop it by four by five, right? But guess what? Oh crap. You could do this, but it'll crop out the feet. You could do this, but it'll crop out the hand. What do we do? Have no fear. This is what you'll do so that it can fit on Instagram. And as you can see here, this is artificial. This background, it's not even real, like how I even took the photo. So let me show you what I did. First thing you want to do, okay? First thing you want to do is go to photo, Edit in Adobe Photoshop 2021, okay? So that's gonna open the photo up in Photoshop. Boom. What you're gonna do is you're gonna double click on background, okay? To unlock it. After you double click that, you click C or go to the crop tool and expand the photo just bigger in general, right? Because in order to do it, in order to crop it down for Instagram, it needs to be it needs to fit the dimensions, right? So let's pretend we've already edited, we've already color corrected this photo, whatever. So you've expanded it, you click check. Boom. Now what you're gonna do is, you're gonna go to this tool right here. You can, Look, you can either use the lasso tool or the rectangular tool. I'm gonna use the rectangular marquee tool. You click it, you go over the area you want to expand. So this, right? Because the top of our photo is not long enough for Instagram. So you do that, then you go to edit content aware scale. So, so Photoshop's like AI is going to recognize the background and you're going to expand it. Literally, it's expanding your background. Like you took the photo that way, but you didn't. It is incredible. Then you can do the same thing at the bottom of your photo. Okay, same thing, edit content aware scale. Now we're going to drag it down. Wow, this is getting crazy. Now do it again. Okay, you got to copy this side. Now notice if you do it too much, though, it'll stretch it out. But I'm just doing it this way. Edit content aware scale and stretch it out, stretching out the edges. <laughs> All right, same thing here. Okay, and we're gonna do edit, continue to wear scale, and we're gonna drag this little border over. Actually, let's do that again. Okay, we're gonna get more of it this time. We're gonna go way over here to get more stuff for Photoshop to know to copy. All right, all the way down, edit, content to wear scale, drag it over. <laughs> and you know you want to look as natural as possible you don't want to look stretched but then look okay we could do command d for deselect and then you're like yo so then what you can do now you click file save okay and now when you save that it's going to change how it looks in instagram okay now look what happens if we go to here click this do four by five now Boom. Isn't that amazing? So what used to not fit, okay, what used to be like this <laughs> is now like this. Crazy, but this is the photo I'm gonna post. So if you guys wanna follow me on my photography Instagram page, check it out. Appreciate it. Yo, I don't know about you guys, but that is fire. And for the record, this is not something that you go to use like all the time. This is really when you're like in a pinch and you're like, dang, I really want to post that photo on Instagram, but it's not fin in fitting Instagram's dimensions. And uh, this is just a little, you know what I'm saying, a little hat, you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying? Anywho, if you, if you guys really enjoy this type of content, leave a thumbs up below. I hope I helped you guys out. Like I know how it is as a content creator and you're like, 
yo, like, I really want to post this photo. And, you, you know, you spend all this time, like, just having fun and taking photos. So, you know, just, just figured out I would share this with you guys. Follow me on Instagram at the Brandon Lee Cook, and you can follow my photography Instagram at Brandon Lee Media. And uh, yeah, you guys. Oh, side note, I'm coming out with some presets. So if you guys like the way I edit photos, you like the color palette and all that kind of stuff, presets coming soon. Y'all. If you guys like this video, press thumbs up below. Comment below if you guys know of an application that can do the same thing. Follow for more photography, video, social media marketing tips for creators. All right, peace.